Ngayon magdi-discuss tayo ng uh, another sample problem for uh, thin walled uh, pressure vessels. So the problem statement, uh, cylindrical pressure vessel is fabricated from steel, so steel yung material natin, that has a thickness of uh, 20 mm. So, so diameter of the pressure vessel is 450 mm and its length is 2 meters. Pero actually hindi naman pagtitingnan natin yung mga equation natin ng stresses in pressure vessels, wala namang length na ano na. But anyway, it's given, determine the maximum internal uh, pressure that can be applied if the longitudinal stress is limited to 140 megapascals and the circumferential stress or the tangential stress is, uh, is limited to 60 megapascals. So, ngayon, binigyan tayo ng mga allowable stresses for our uh, tangential and circumferential or oh, tangential and longitudinal stress. So, anyway, ang kukunin lang natin dito is uh, P no, or the internal pressure that can be applied. So, medyo madali lang to. Play lang natin yung uh, PD over 2T and then known bale yung stress natin. So, given for tangential or circumferential, we have 60 megapascals. The diameter is given as 450 millimeters and then we have thickness 20 millimeters. So, therefore, you will have P equals 5.33 megapascals. Okay? In terms naman of uh, longitudinal stress, we have PD over 40. So, P times uh, diameter is given as uh, 450 millimeters. Thickness is also given. So, execute lang natin ito. No? 140 times 80 divided by 450 equals P, which is now equal to 24.89 megapascals. Okay. Now, with this uh, given allowable stresses, there can only be one single value for P that would satisfy both allowable stresses. So, para mag-maintain na safe yung vessel natin, uh, kailangan natin pumili ng P no? based dito sa mga nakuha natin. So, ang P na mapipiliin natin, of course, is yung safe yung dalawang stresses. So, which is uh, 5.33 megapascals. Uh, hindi natin ito pipiliin kasi pag uh, ito yung pinili natin, nag-fail na ito. Kasi hanggang 5.33 megapascals lang yung kaya niya. Which is the internal pressure. Okay? So, Dapat ang internal pressure na papasok sa vessel is uh, 5.33 or less para ayun, hindi mag uh, hindi magfail in both um, circumferential and longitudinal na aspect ng ating vessel. Okay? So that's it for, uh, that's it for this uh, problem. So thank you again for uh, joining. So medyo madali lang to, no? Uh, and then uh, ayun, see you sa mga see you sa next lesson natin. Thank you.